Everyone likes to watch the waves hitting and splashing water on a rocky beach. We could spend hours watching that. But while enjoying that, you might notice some white ring-like structures on these rocks. They are hard and won't break off easily even if you try to. Have you ever wondered what it is? A modified rock, maybe? No. It is not any type of rock, but an organism. It is the outer shell produced by an organism called barnacles. Barnacles are animals closely related to crabs and lobsters and belong to the same group, Crustacea. They are exclusively marine and live in the tidal waters. Barnacles are sessile, meaning they are always found permanently attached to a hard substratum. Most barnacles have cement glands to attach them to the substratum. This cement is one of the most powerful glues on Earth. They also secrete hard calcium plates that encase their body. The shell protects them from predation as well as tidal currents and desiccation. Since most of barnacles live in the intertidal region, during low tide, they close the shell with four such plates, to avoid drying out. It is during high tide that they open the top plates and start feeding. They are suspension feeders and have long feather-like limbs called cirri. The cirri is rapidly extended and retracted through the top of the barnacle, to trap the microscopic organisms. There exists about 1400 species of barnacles throughout the world and the common type of barnacle is acorn barnacle. Another type is called gooseneck barnacle, which has a long stalk to attach it to the substratum. Barnacles usually live in colonies. Barnacles are of serious concern as they are well known for fouling and as a parasite. They attach on the body of marine animals including whales and turtles. The growth of barnacles can cause infection and other diseases to the host. The barnacles can also cause fouling, where the barnacle colonies grow extensively over any man-made structure. It can damage hulls of ships, pillars, and piers. When these barnacle colonies are attached, it affects the weight and design of the ship and cause more friction. It drags the ship and leads to more fuel consumption. Corrosion also takes place faster than normal. To save the ships from these fowlers, the ships are taken out of water and cleaned yearly. This process is called dry docking. You can imagine the economic loss and efforts wasted for this process. The reproduction of barnacle is interesting. They are hermaphrodites, meaning there are both male and female barnacles. The male transfers the sperm into a nearby female barnacle through a long tube. The fertilized egg is released by the female and the shrimp-like larvae called Nauplius swims freely across the water. When it grows to cyprid larvae, it stops feeding and finds a good place to settle down. The adult barnacles secrete a chemical which attracts the cyprid larvae to settle nearby. It attaches to a hard substrate and cement itself there and grow into a sessil, adult barnacle and the cycle continues. If you wish to know more about interesting marine life, subscribe to our YouTube channel.